Okay, so this is going to be my final video for my April 2016 period storage. And I just keep it in this drawer in one of my dressers. And I do have an organizing video on this in case you want to see it. But um, this is a brief overview. And I'll move some things so you can see what everything looks like. So it's more so like that. And the funny thing is that this is actually some girl's period storage alone. And this is just my overflow of things that do not fit in my storage. So right here, um, I just have some Playtex Sport regular tampons. But they don't fit in the um, container. And then I have some Pure and Gentle Fragrance Free Wipes, 90 count. And then right here, I have my Yuba Codex Cleaner regular 50 count. And these are the newer ones, or the different different ones. Alright, so um, how it organizes is Maxi Tampon Liners. Regular, regular maxi, overnight maxi, and then over ultra thins. So right there, um, here to here, these are my always ultra thin overnights. And if you want a video like this, um, where I can do like different storage ideas, um, I have a lot of different containers I could put some few items in and stuff like that. And also com comment down below if you want um, my next storage video to look like this where I um, show you like which part is which, and then I show you the pad. Um, I don't really know how long it'd be. It'd be um, probably four to five videos, if not more. But anyway, um, these are the always ultra thin regulars, and those are just all of these. And right here, I actually have some summer Z wipes, and I think those just from a kit or something. I just put those in there right now, or for it. Yes, for right now. Um, here to here, these are the always infinity overnights um the regular overnights and this is the current packaging i like it it's really nice and then from here to here these are the always infinity radiant overnights <clears throat> and um, i have current and old packaging again i'm trying to split up current and old but i'm trying to use up the current first because old well, I can't buy it anymore. And then all of this, um, these maxis right here, these are the always maxi overnights. I think these are the unscented ones. And then from here to here, um, these are compared to the always ultra things. But these, I think, are the CVS ultra things, I believe. And, um, and a piece of hair. Um, all of these, these are the, again, CVS maxis, which are actually pretty soft. It's just that sometimes CVS things can be expensive. I don't remember how much these were. Um, from here to here, these are the Oys, Oys, um, Radiant and Premier, Oys and Premier Radiant, and I do not have one opened. And the next pink ones, those are the old packaging of the Always and Living the Ingredient Total Chain. That just looks like that. And then um, right here, I have some liners. Um, Carefree Body Sheep Active Fresh Regular to go. And then these are the Always Radiant Liners wrapped. Which someone wanted me to do a review on them, and I'm sorry I didn't get that done. And then I just have some more radiance, and under that I have some carefree, um, right there, if you can see that. And then right here, um, I have a combo pack of tampons. It is a Tampax radiance of regulars and supers. These are the regulars, and these are the supers. I don't know how much I use, but this is the old packaging. And then back here, I have, um, my... CVS compact um, regular and super tampons. Um, I don't really like these that much, so that's why they're kind of in here as well. And then all of these, and I do have a double row. Um, I really like how tall these drawers are. Looks lets me store a lot. Um, these are the Stay Free Maxi regulars, which I have tons and tons of um, from a bundle I got, but. As you can tell, my uh, store or my pad or excuse me, my maxi pad drawer, um, it doesn't work for me. So I'm thinking of actually moving it into here. Or um, I have a container which I bought at the Dollar General. My local. I dropped it. Hold on. 
It's hard to get this big of a box with one hand. Um, shut the door. Um, it's this big. It's rather large. And um, I think I'm going to, I might put my maxi in here because it's a pretty good um, amount of space. And I'm hoping it'll fit in here. So, um, yeah, I might put my maxis in here and just put this in my closet and then turn that drawer into something else. I do not know what, but, um, yeah, this is really all I got for my April 2016 period storage. Thank you girls for watching. And I just realized I actually have some more radiant liners right here. And I have, like, random boxes around my room, but it's all good. Anyway, um, like this video and thanks for watching.